Welcome to Around the World Channel. Lionel Messi PSG debut. Superstar comes off bench. Mbappe scores twice in Paris Saint-Germain win versus Reims. CBSSports.com. Reims. Lionel Messi finally made his PSG debut on Sunday, coming off the bench in the club's 2-0 win away at Stade de Reims in Ligue 1. Hurricane Ida Live Updates. New Orleans under flash flood warning after Category 4 landfall, go.com. Category 4 Hurricane Ida, moving northwest at 11 mph, is slamming Louisiana with powerful winds, torrential rain and dangerous storm surge. Tropical Storm Julian forms in the Atlantic, the New York Times. Another landfall, on the eastern coast of Mexico's mainland, left at least eight people dead, and Henri formed on August 16 as a tropical storm off the east coast of the United States. Biden oversees, dignified transfer of U.S. service members killed in Kabul, NPR. President Joe Biden watches as a Navy carry team moves a transfer case containing the remains of Navy Corpsman Maxton W. Soviak, 22, of Berlin Heights, Ohio, Sunday, August. Elizabeth Holmes again a top media topic ahead of Theranos trial, Fox Business. It wasn't long ago that the world was captivated by the story of Elizabeth Holmes and her ill-fated Theranos company. SpaceX launches ants, avocados, robot to space station, ksl.com. Cape Canaveral, Florida. A SpaceX shipment of ants, avocados and a human-sized robotic arm rocketed toward the International Space Station on Sunday. Afghanistan. Final flights arriving as UK's campaign ends, BBC News. By George Bowden BBC News image source Crown copyright the final flights bringing British troops home from Afghanistan are arriving, as the UK's 20-year military campaign ends. Report card. Illinois fighting Illini 30, Huskers 22 Corn Nation. I expected more. There, I said it. I used the lack of Big Ten quality receivers as my explanation as to why Nebraska's offense regressed from the end of 2018. Hands-on. Samsung's S Pen case for Galaxy Z Fold 3 makes the Note roll over in its grave 9 to 5 Google. Samsung has foregone the Galaxy Note series this year in favor of its foldables, specifically the Galaxy Z Fold 3.